Chad Andrews catching up with Kenneth Fareed here at the uh, Nuggets practice court. Longest tenured Nugget. How, how does that feel for you now that you're, you're seven years in? And, and what's it like to be uh, the guy who's been around here longest? Uh, it's an honor, I guess. Uh, like, it's hard because, you know, I, I'd rather have been around here like, and continue the wins that we, like, when I first got here. But we haven't been able to do that. And like, it's been a lot of downs recently. I mean, four years of not making the playoffs. That's tough, like, you know, with anybody. And so for me, it's been tough. Like, but I'm like, you know what? This year, we got to come in with a different mindset. Defense, offense got to be better. Uh, whole, I mean, like training, gotta, you know, everything's just got to be different and better. And I'm excited about this year. It is going to be a defensive camp. Michael Malone makes no bones about that. How, how do you translate how you have developed, how you've improved there, and how do you communicate that message that if 57 wins is going to happen again like you've experienced, this has got to be better? Uh, well, for me, we had the, George Carl had us where he literally told us our role. And that's what it has to be better this year, I think, more so. Uh, everybody don't know their roles. Everybody don't abide by their roles either. So we have to really install roles on people. Like, hey, this is your role every night. You come out here and do this. George Carl told me my role was to come out, play with energy as a starter, come out with energy, start the game off right, and make sure that the other starters are starting off right. For me, it's, it's huge for me to start because that's how my mentality and mindset start off. Start off with the energy to burst everybody needs to get us going. That's right away. <laughs> Come on, guys, let's do it. Well, when you look at this basketball team, Kenneth, what do you see? Honestly, I don't know. <laughs> I see a, a bunch of guys ready to play. Like, to me, like, it's exciting. It should be an exciting year. Uh, hopefully we get a lot of fans back this year. I mean, last year we was right there, right there when it comes to the playoffs. And he was pushing for us to go, wanted to see us go. So to me, this year is like, if we don't make the playoffs, then it's a waste of the year. Okay. <laughs> You've had to fight for your minutes since you were a rookie. Is it any different now? <sighs> Back to square one, I guess. Yeah. Uh, no disrespect, I understand how the league goes. You bring Millsap in because he's a great acquisition to this team. Like, of course, he's an all-star. Like, he deserves that. Like, uh, he deserves the 390. And he deserves the minutes that he probably was going to get. Like, but I'm going to still fight, to, of course, to be on the court. And to me, I'm not a, like, and I'll put this out there for everybody to know, I'm not a bitch player. Like, I've been, like, saying that for the longest. I'm a starter. Like, I love to come up, like, I love to hit the crowd. Hey, starting at uh, power forward, number 35, Kenneth Free. Yes, that's me. 100%, that's been my whole life. And I'm going to fight for my starting position. I'm not just going to let it lay down here. Let somebody take it. But if they give it to them, I can't control that. Right. And... Whether it's 12 minutes or 35 minutes. You go to team animal. Okay. Every time I step on a court, like literally, like for me, like I've seen so much stuff happen in this league. It's 29 other teams. If this team doesn't want like, or respect me enough to play me the minutes or whatever that I'm going to play, like, or I think I deserve to play, then I understand that. Hey, there's 29 others. Maybe I go somewhere else and do what I need to do there. But at the same token, I'm here at Denver, and I'm going to play manual basketball no matter what every time I step on that court. This summer added a hell of a chip on your shoulder, huh? Huh? This summer added a hell of a chip on your oh, shoulder. Oh, huh? you have no idea. I'm excited to see it, man. 